is spicy. Can you guys handle spicy food? Cool. Welcome to Dig In Buffalo, brought to you by Orville's. Today we're gonna roll with Texas hot chicken. Smoked, then fried half chicken. A little bit of Texas, a little bit of India. The smoking part of it is very Texas. Everything else is how they do it in South India. It's called Kerala fried chicken there. So it's like my closest approximation of it based on what I ate growing up. We put together a marinade. So just basically a little bit of everything and then we go heavy on the ginger and garlic in here. Blend it all together. And then we just go over the top with our barbecue rubs. Just give it some color. So it's everything that a tandoori rub has in it, but without the food color. So just call it Texas. <laughs> Now that the chicken's rested for a few hours, we go straight to the smoker. When I put my chickens in the smoker, I always go dark meat side towards the heat source. That way you don't overcook the breast on it. Chicken's been in here for about two hours. So I'll usually cool them on a rack, and then I'll hit it with a little coconut oil as well. And this then goes into my walk-in cooler to like rest overnight, let the skin tighten back up again. So at this point, it's ready to go into our wok for the final stage. I use the wok because it heats up so quickly. Beets using a fryer, beets using all that stuff, you use less oil, you can get more seasoning into the chicken. Wok style cooking is uh, pretty prevalent in Southern India. You know, a lot of street vendors and stuff like that use their own version of a wok. Once the onions start getting a little translucent, I add my spice mix to it. I did say it was a hot chicken. Oh, it'll get you good. Let the whole thing get some color and then we just add the chicken to the pot. Turn off the heat, you can plate the rest of the dish. So this is just coconut rice, because this has so much flavor to it, you don't want to do all the other saucy stuff too. Take some of this really cool caramelized onions. It's a little spicy, but sort of sweet at this point. Hell yeah, that's like super tender and everything. Top it with some of our pickle red onions. And there you have it, Texas hot chicken. That's a mouthful too. <laughs>